yeah i've not done a video for a while so i just wanted to do a short video just with a lot of situation um, and some of that's come up comes up it's coming up more regular than often but then obviously when it's closer to home and it's quite around you you know it's good these things are good to kind of get out there and go off previous experiences so it's a little video here guys and i'm just gonna you know we're gonna talk about devil's dust let's just put it that way so when we're on about devil's dust we're on about you know what i'm talking about we're on about cocaine you know what i mean and that's what it is it's devil's dust so nine times out of ten now most people get to the end of the week and then they'll go and get you know they'll go out partying they'll go and get a bag they'll go and get themselves a packet and then when they're out they'll be fueled upon that packet and then nine times out of ten the behavior the way they carry on is going to be a bit erratic because they're on the packet or they'll go and get them still going they'll go back to an after party an house party and they'll order three more packets or the team for whatever they're going to order and then they'll be kitchen gangsters all night then they'll be curtain switching and then they'll go home or they'll, they'll stay up another night but eventually they'll go home and they'll sleep or they'll try to but before they started the devil toss and this isn't with everybody but it's the majority of the subjects we're going to touch on before you start the devil's dust you've probably got about 101 things running through here and a lot of people what they tend to find is they'll hit the devil's dust on a weekend to black out what's in here is the problems but fast forward now till after you've had your party you've had your bender you've spent all your money on your packets you lay out, you, you, you're on your way home, you are home, reality kicks in. All them demons that you wanted to, that you've just blacked out for the past two days because of the devil's dust smack you in the brick tenfold because they come back. The all them problems come back worse than what they was before you hit the devil's dust. You know, and that's the issue we've got. And then when you've got them problems now, you're stressed, you're depressed, your mood swings are all over the place. Do you know what I mean? You're not the same person. There's two things you're gonna do that you tend to do is either get back on the devil dust or you go through a severe, severe depression time. And you depress, your head's all over the place. And then you don't know which way to turn and you know and unfortunately a case around me recently, a young lad took his life. You know. And it was it's sad it was sad the reason it was sad is because you know he's 19 he had his whole life ahead of him he had everything going on everything going on you know but he didn't see it you know because he's you know he's young and what happens when you're on your come down for the devil's dust you start getting into it you have every single individual here suffers with mental health and no one can tell me they don't but people's mental health states increase more than others and especially when you're on the devil's dust like i said you know, it also it increases your mental health. Now, like I said, some people can have the have the dust there, the nose candy, and it can be all right. You know, and they can have it as a party thing and so forth. Good for them. But some people can't, and the people that can't outweighs the people that can. So that's why I'm doing this video here, man. So, and this video here resonates with everybody because there's not one person that's going to watch this video that doesn't do it or 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 has, hasn't done it, you know, every single person's done it and some people are still doing it. That's just the society we're living in. It's the way it is. So rather than, you know, I understand, rather than black that out for that pressure that you that's getting you on the devil's dust, try and find another way to get around it, you know what I mean? Because like saying, as soon as you're on your come down, reality kicks in. And when it kicks in, it kicks in twice as hard as what it was before you started, started your bender. So rather than spending all your money at the end of the week on the dust and putting it in another man's pocket, keep it in your own pocket, keep yourself a bit richer. Do you know what I mean? Because that's one of the, for me, that's a form, that's one of the forms of, of evil. Do you know what I mean? We've all been there. Every single one of us has been there. Do you know what I mean? And like you're saying, when reality kicks in, when you're on that stuff there, it kicks in 10 times worse. Do you know what I mean? Like you're saying, and then a lot of people suffer with mental health and when you suffer with mental health, a severe case of mental health through the dust, 
you know, we've all had friends there what that's gone home and you know they've decided to take their own life and it's you know it's happened it's been around me, it's happened to me on a few occasions. You know, where they've just gone, you woke up the next day, took his own life and and that's down to the devil's dust. But I wouldn't say you can't always blame it on the devil's dust, but the devil's dust makes it ten times worse, it just speeds things up, speeds up your depression. Do you know what I mean? And there's no life. When you're on that way, when you have that, you don't really have a life. You know, all you're living for is the dust, do you know what I mean? And that's it, find other ways, guys. But yeah, so I'm putting the video out here because it's Saturday because most people, as you know, they do the Friday or they might, they might think about going out buying a few packets tonight and so forth. For the people that can do it, fine, that's up to them. But for the people that suffer mentally, you know, just remember when you're on it, it's going to cost you. Your mental health state's going to increase and, you know, your behaviour your behavior can come right. And just think that all the money you spend on it, why not just keep that money in your own pocket and spend it on spend it on things nicer things in life. That's it. So I'm not going to touch on it or, or anything else about that. But you know, before you go out and buy that devil's dust and put that shit up your nose, think of yourself, put yourself first, put your mental health frame of mind first. You know what I mean? Because that won't be that will not put you in a better place. Trust me when I say that. Mark my words. Hope everyone has a good weekend. God bless. Take care. Love all. Nice one.